5S stands for sort, set in order, shine, standardize, and sustain. These are the steps that we use to clean up and organize in a lean factory. The more organized an area is, the more efficient it is because the operators are not walking around all over the place trying to find things. They only have exactly what they need at their workstations, nothing more and nothing less. And it's organized in a way that's optimally efficient. So when a work area is messy and inefficient, you wanna to put together a Kaizen team and start sorting things out. You wanna get rid of anything that's not needed. All excess tools and supplies need to be removed from the work area. And a good way to do this is to use a red tag system and red tag all the potentially unnecessary things. You want your red tags to be sequentially numbered so each one's unique. And the form should have two parts. The first section of the red tag should be a description of the item that you're gonna red tag. And the other section should have a check checkbox of three different questions. Is the item needed? Is the item needed in that location? Is the item needed in that quantity? The tag should be a two part tag too. One part gets taped onto the item that you red tagged and the other part gets brought up to the Kaizen room for discussion. So you wanna have the team hit the production floor and start red tagging everything that they're not sure about. And it's okay to go tag crazy because we're just asking questions at this point. Then the team will discuss each tag individually. And if you don't need an item at the machine but the item's not trash, then create a red tag area. And a red tag area, it's just a roped off space where all the unneeded items go until a future disposition can be made. After you sort out all the unneeded items, you wanna to start to set them in order. And you start to organize your things. And the best way to do that is with shadow boards. Even on the production floor, you wanna outline where things go. Your trash can should even get squares or circles around them to identify the proper locations. The third S is shine. And you're gonna to wanna to shine everything. Basically, you need to get out the rags and the cleaning solution, and get some elbow, elbow grease working and clean everything really well. Move pallets and small equipment if you can and have the floor scrubbed and really cleaned up too. The fourth of the five S's is to standardize. You're gonna to wanna to develop standards for your lean system. Come up with color-coded systems that are consistent throughout your factory. Determine how your KPI boards are gonna be displayed and that should be consistent too. These standards should be all shared and enforced plant-wide. And you're gonna to wanna to develop a 5S audit and an audit frequency. There's a lot of good 5S audits online. So take a look at those and determine one that's gonna work well for your factory. The fifth and last step of the 5S process is sustain. You're gonna to wanna to make sure that you have a good system in place to maintain all the hard work that your Kaizen team did. Your company's gonna to wanna to create a 5S document, like a written policy, a work instruction, or a workmanship standard. It's really easy for 5S to slip away and it happens in companies all the time. So having a sustainability plan is the most important and most commonly overlooked step of the 5S process. So you definitely develop a sustainability plan. Mm -hmm.